What is up, YouTube, man? We're back here with another video, man. And before I say anything else, happy Thanksgiving. I hope you guys are having a wonderful Thanksgiving dinner. Now, back to the topic at hand, man, on how to gain more views on your gaming YouTube channel. This applies to all types of videos, whether it's vlogs, whatever it is, reactions. This still applies well, but the main thing I'm going to be talking about here is gaming. So if you don't want to hear me talk about that, you can go ahead and leave right now. But first things first, let's, I'm going to say this right now. Throw out equipment. We're not talking about equipment right now in this video. We're talking about one thing and one thing only: uh, gaining, your, growing your YouTube channel. Because you can, you don't have to have the top-notch equipment, spend all this money to gain, to get your subs and views. You can do it at a budget price and still get the same results and save you more money and then add on in the future and improve your content. Now, first things first. The first thing I want to say is tags and descriptions. This is the main thing I'm, I'm gonna talk about because this is the most important thing out of all of the topics. Mainly is tags and descriptions. One, I'm talking about descriptions right now. I'm gonna have a video, uh, a little bit of a slide, uh, a little bit of video for you guys on how you should have your descriptions. Shout out to my boy Trey Beyond Gaming. This is how you should have your description box down below. Talk about the video. If you have music or anything else, if you're doing a reaction video, leave a link in the description box down below and and have some tags at the bottom of the video so we have it at the beginning that people confuse to see. The reason why I say that is because it helps uh, the YouTube search engine rank your video higher in the search. That's why I always do my. If you guys ever see my videos, I have a shitload of sub, uh, shitload of tags in my description box down below. Every time, no matter what, if I have to go re-edit my videos, I always do that every time. That is key. Have a nice description box. Now have a nice description. Next is your tags. Tag. And I and I preach this so much. You guys would I know how much I preach this. Because back then, I have been doing us uh, um for four years. Back then it really didn't matter too much about tag, but now it's very important to get you ranked higher in search. Now I have three things you can do. One, I have two websites that that will give you tags if you're too lazy to do it. It will be keywordtool.io and it will be rapid tags. Now, the third thing I'm talking about is TubeBuddy. It's not a sponsored video, but TubeBuddy is a uh, YouTube uh, extension that allows you to uh, see what tags you can use. It's, 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 it's badass, trust me. You can type in a topic and it tells you how, how well it's uh, searched. It gives you trending topics and they also tell you auto auto suggested. So that's what something I personally recommend. That has really been my main success for my YouTube channel over the past four to three months. I'm telling you guys, it has helped me grow so much. Now, before I move on to the next topic, you're probably thinking right now, why should I listen to a person who has 68 subs, but you're talking about gaining views subscribers? For one, nine times out of 10, you're not gonna reach majority of your subs. Not, and guess, we don't know why I said it, because majority, I have two channels. Well, I'm only three, but I'm only working on two. I have a thousand subs on there, I have 68 subs on here. I have 400, almost 400,000 total views on that channel, and 20K views, in this channel within two, three, two to three months. Four, I think, August. So yeah, the reason why I'm saying that is because over time, you're only gonna reach about 10 to 5%. More majority of my videos, 95% who watch my videos are non-subscribers. 5% is my sub base. So it really doesn't matter what I'm talking about, views, not subscribers, it's the topic of the video. Next thing I wanna say is do what is searched. This is the main thing, another main thing that is very key, especially in gaming. The videos I post are Madden, 2K, whatever sports related, I post on this channel. For instance, 2K18. I'm telling you boys, man, people search up build videos every day. And that's what people are searching for. So what I do, make build videos. There's no, there's no, <laughs> there's no any other way. So I make build videos, get out of us very search. If you post something, a game that's about 20 years ago, and you have a, a slow subscriber base, it's gonna be hard for you to be, to be searched because it's, people are not really searching for that. Call of Duty. That's okay, but so many people post it so much, it's kind of hard. Now, people who are have about 10K subs and up, sometimes they don't even use tags. I look at their videos, they don't use tags, and they still have a lot of views because they have a higher subscriber base and they're ranked higher in the search engine. So, that's something you must take into consideration. So you, so do videos that are basically searched. Take pride in what you do. Now, next topic is probably the last one is thumbnails. I have another video right now of how your thumbnail should look. If it's just gameplay in the background, but you have a shit ton of views, you did something right. Because for one, it is, it is searchable and people say, okay, it's a lot of views. Let me check it out. Now, if you're not using a nice thumbnail, there are numerous ways you can make a thumbnail, especially on PlayStation, you use it on the internet, what is it like, PicMonkey and stuff like that. I have Photoshop. It's so many ways. Please make a professional thumbnail. If you just freaking type, put in text, that's all that matters. If you want to go more in depth, yes, there's tutorials on YouTube to help you make these awesome ass thumbnails. And trust me, it does help to have a thumbnail because it, it makes you look professional. And the next topic I have is be monetized. 
you need to be rewarded for what you do. Be compensated because, for one, you put time and effort into making these videos. You should you should get paid for it. Now, I, I'm not going to talk too much more in-depth about the monetization. Please don't get copyrighted in any shape or form. Strike or claim. You deserve to be paid. You don't need any trouble with YouTube. Trust me. You don't want to do in, deal with anything in regard to that BS. So, that's all the t tips I have for you guys today, man. I don't want to take you guys too much of your time. Hope you guys have a blessed day. I'll see you, boy. Let them out. Peace.